Good afternoon, everyone. Will Dupree here in the KXAN live studio. We wanted to pass along something that might affect your commute this afternoon or potentially this evening and it might cause some delays. So this is just for a heads up. Right now, crews are working to repair a broken gas line in northeast Austin. I want to pull up a map so that you can see where exactly this is. So if you'll give me just one second, I'll get this up so we can show you the exact area where crews are now working to fix a broken gas line that is now under repair and it's led to some road closures. So we'll take a look at this map that you can see right here. We'll go full screen. It's a Google map, everyone. This little red area where it is marked is exactly where the crews are working at this point. We'll zoom in here. This is in Northeast Austin, right by kind of where 183 and 290 cross. What we're told is that this broken gas line happened somewhere here on Old Maynard Road, Old Manor Road and Springdale Road right here by Pecan Brook Drive. So this particular area where I'm circling with my mouse, it's Springdale Road, Old Manor Road, and Pecan Brook Drive. This area is closed right now because of a broken gas line. What we're told by Texas Gas, we got this information not too long ago, is that a call came in to them at about 11 this morning Texas Gas is saying that a contractor working in that area struck a two-inch gas line and it broke. Now, gas will be turned off soon in that area. It most likely has at this point. Texas Gas, though, says there are no evacuations to speak of at this point, but we will continue to, continue to monitor that situation um, until necessary if that needs to be passed along. One other thing I want to bring you all is uh, some tweets. This is from the Austin Transportation Department. If you take a look here, they're sending out an alert there. Springdale is closed to through traffic at Pecan Brook for utility repair. This is where that two inch gas line was ruptured this morning at about 11 o'clock. So if you're headed out that area to Northeast Austin, this is what you're gonna run into some road closures as they try to fix this broken gas line. One other tweet to bring up, Here's this one from Austin Police Department. It's a traffic advisory of everybody. Intersections of Springdale Road with Pecan Brook Drive and Old Manor Road are closed due to a gas line break. Police are on scene. Please avoid this area. And again, right there, that's the important part. No estimated time for reopening at the moment. So keep this in mind as you're heading home this evening. Again, we'll pull up this map one more time so you can show exactly where this is. And if you're out driving, if you work in that area or live there, keep this in mind tonight as you're heading home. One second, I'll pull up this map and then we'll reiterate one more time where this is. Let's take a look at this full screen. It's a Google map, everyone. This particular area right here, just to the east of US 183, Springdale Road, between Pecan Brook Drive and Old Manor Road there are closed. This whole area is closed right now because of that broken gas line. What Texas Gas is telling us is that there are no evacuations to report right now, even though there are so many businesses as well as a Montessori school right there, a sports complex and some other buildings. It's not affecting anyone at this point. If we hear something different, we will pass that along to you all. But we just wanted to reiterate that this is happening out there in Northeast Austin so that you can get ready for this um, and prepare for it accordingly because it's about 2 o'clock now. A few more hours until everyone starts heading home from work. And this will affect your drive if you're in that area. Again, this is just east of US 183 on uh, Springdale Road between Old Manor Road and Pecan Brook. So again, play, pay attention, everybody. We will have more information on our website, kxan.com and the KXAN News app. Of course, we're going to be tracking this to let you all know when this road reopens. However, right now, they are unsure how long it will take to break or to fix, rather, this broken gas line, which was reported at about 11 this morning. A contractor struck the two-inch line, and now work is starting to try to fix it.